My guy, Freddie P, man. Let's get right into it. Diddy, he got indicted. How you feel about that? Um, it was a surprise to me, bro. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Like, when you see Puff, it's, it's kind of a surprise. But like I told my brother, man, you know, he was telling me he don't think Puff gonna get locked up. I said, bitch, they got Chapo. You know what I'm saying? Like I was telling you earlier, they got Chapo. They could put Chapo under the ground. They could hide Puff. But it was, it's, it's, it's just long overdue. Like for a while, it made me kind of question. Like, damn, you know, it's to the point where it felt like they forced him, forced the feds to do their job. He forced the feds to do their job because if they didn't do it, everybody looking at them like, "What? Do you motherfuckers exist?" You know what I'm saying? Like, he done got away with too much. But you gotta understand this, right? A lot of stuff Puffy going through, and I don't wish bad on him. Like. Before this transpired, I had a lot of hatred toward him, but it was about financial th reasons. Um, when it comes to this subject, it's very sensitive to me because it's a lot of victims in here. You know what I'm saying? And that is. When is this Diddy stuff going to end, man? It's so much more stuff that's going to be revealed. And Freddie P is telling us. He's saying, oh, it's a, he, this is just a tip of the iceberg. It's some more. He said it's some stuff that's about to drop. And we better be ready for it. And you know I'm going to cover it as soon as it drops. The minute it's going to be up on here. You hear me? But put y'all cash up in the comments, man. Y'all know how I do. Also, if y'all want to join the $1,000 giveaway, all you got to go subscribe to the channel. Go follow me on Instagram at 200 underscore acre short. And the giveaway. We'll be doing the giveaway live on this channel October 22nd. You don't want to miss it. But, hey, let's get into the video, fam. At the, end of the at the end of the day, it's still somebody's father. You know what I'm saying? So, but we make our own bed, man. And for a long time, he, uh, a lot of people, I want him to understand that a lot of people was hurt. Because you just you you couldn't live your truth. All this, all everything he going through right now is because he couldn't let go. He couldn't let go being having a position of power over street nigga and also being who he is. The more who he who he was, he had to show more aggression. That's like when I suck my thumb. When I grew up, I, the reason people might think I'm tough and right is, is transpired because when I was in it, places sucking my thumb. I knew I had to go extra hard for you to know not to play with me. You get what I'm saying? Like it made me turn into somebody else because you might take a perception of me sucking my thumb. You might think I'm soft. You might think I'm gay, anything. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like with him. If people know his secrets, because believe one thing about it, you know, and that's with all these rappers. Somebody know your secrets. You might be get, yeah, you and Puffy getting. You know, because Puffy, I can imagine he approached these guys who are going through financial situations, these rappers who get themselves, start making a lot of money, then when things don't be um, hot no more, you fall back on people like him. He, he prey on you. And what he do is he, he offer you things to keep up a lifestyle. You can imagine, imagine Puffy, Playboy. You know, Playboy, don't worry, man, don't worry about that, man. I, I can get us, a, come, come with me to the island, Playboy. Come chill with me. Won't be no security guards, no nothing. Won't nobody know about your business. Hey, don't worry about that. I'll wire that, Playboy. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, it's a lot of rappers out here that got secrets because they fell into them situations. But that's how he do. He play on the week. But that's, that's how every P word works. They wait till you at your weakest moment and then try to exploit it. You know what I'm saying? And you, we already know Diddy's a master at it. He's a master. With Puffy. And I know this personally. Like, I I know personally, but like I say, a lot of stuff that I know, like I knew a lot of stuff that came out this week we was talking about. I was like, man, I've been through that. I been knew about the girl that came out. She was just afraid to tell her story for a long time. Like I knew, sir, when you're in a circle, like the band is like a, you know what I'm saying? So things that transpired in they band, they, because they work with people that we worked with, you know what I'm saying? It gets back to us. And not only that, I don't been on a phone call and hear people explaining their situations, explain, crying about, you know, the, uh, situations. And it only gonna get worse. Like I was telling people like, I, I um, 
it's hard to say because I don't want to spoil what's coming up. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to. I just want to say this. Like I said, it gets it gets deeper and deeper. And the more the more that come out, the more intriguing the story going to be. All I want to tell people is when that Netflix series come out, it's a rapper coming out with a Netflix series. I won't say no name. I don't want to spoil it for him. I don't, I'm not a friend of his. I don't want to, you know, um, um, spoil something he got going on. But I will say that must be 50 Cent. I'm thinking he's talking about 50 Cent. He said, there's a rapper coming out with a Netflix series. What rapper come out with dope series? It's got to be 50. And it's going to be for a large bag. You can feel what I'm saying? If he's selling it to Netflix, it's for a big bag. Because that's going to break. Boy, it's going to break Netflix. You feel me? But that's what I was talking about, bro. He said, hey, he finna release that? I can't wait. <laughs> it is. He's doing a phenomenal job. To the point where I was in awe. You get what I'm saying? I was presented the opportunity to work with him, but you know, like I said, the money wasn't enough for me to leave my couch. But he doing a phenomenal job, man. There's so many people that's hurt behind this. There's so many people that got t so many. But why would he say the money ain't good enough? But what? It's not a, really. That's not even about money. That's about getting your story out and and, and helping victims. You know, this ain't. No, you feel what I'm saying? Like crazy people make everything about money, man. He, y'all, bro. It's guys that will not, that can't come out because of their image. You know what I'm saying? It's that'll make your eyes go like, whoa. I know about it. I know about the slams, the, the Stevie J's. I know you've been, I know, you know, I'm in a circle. I know about y'all. Y'all confirm. You don't got Stevie but J. She, even with Stevie J, you know. Well, I don't mean to stop talking, but Stevie J, that boy been getting his back busted. That boy is a yes. He got busted up a lot. He's a fruit. He's one of them fruities. Got secrets out there of a lifestyle, and you know you the lifestyle you really living. It's a community out there that really know you. You can't hide from them. You can come play tough to us because we don't hear nothing about it. We don't hang around the same crowds. They know you. They know what you and Puffy was going on, not just Stevie J, I'm just saying anybody. If you're in that community and you're trying to hide something, you can hide it from the street dudes and the, and the thugs and the regular, but they know you. And that's what a lot of rappers was facing. That's why a lot of them can't defend themselves. You hear them, they be, ah, nah, nah. If I, they can't really say no because they know somebody know you. Somebody know for a fact. Somebody was there with y'all. Somebody he confided in like as a best friend. You know what I'm saying? That know these rapper secrets. You can imagine being propositioned by Puffy like that, though, right? Like, you fed up. And he, I, he, if he could fly you to a private island and, and get rid of the security and, and give you, a, why are you a million or 20? Or, 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 or make sure that you get this endorsement deal. That's how easy it is for him to get, to gain uh, leverage over people. Come on, man, you got a thousand bottles waiting. I thought, what, 10,000, 5,000, some shit like that? Who, you, my boy, that's a lot of butt back busting, yeah? <laughs> that's too much. I was like, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> it's like you ran a chain of operation. Uh, uh, you got an operation of, of just back busting. <laughs> like, what are y'all, like, what are you, it's not, bro, you 50. Can you even get up that much, bro? No. Like, you that per turned <laughs> on? Like, bro, uh, baby oil? People use baby all this shit for. Well, see, that's a whole nother, that's a whole nother situation. That's a whole nother community. They got their own little. I was like, baby, well, I was, I was like, what baby oil for? We even rubbing each other, each other down, getting shiny and shit. <laughs> then it hit me. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 they, oh, yeah. My boy was loose with it. <laughs> but no, nah, man. You said my boy was loose with it. <laughs> Man, hey, this dude funny, bro. Um, <laughs> prayers to Diddy, man. Prayers to him, man. You know, I don't, I don't, I don't want to kick him out. I, I just ain't that kind of dude. I'm getting mine. Like I say, vengeance is vengeance is mine, said the Lord. There's a lot of Bible Absolutely. passages that pass through this this dude life that was it whatever in the dark shall come to the light. That's one we living out right now. 
is one he living out more than us. Because for so long, um, you got to imagine having that money and that power, secrets. He's literally assaulting men. You get what I mean? Like, it may be common nowadays, but for a man to walk up and slap your ass or let me get your number or come to my hotel room, that's not normal. I ain't never heard no shit like that in my lifetime for no man to approach you like that. And he's done it several times. I just pray for his daughters, man. And um, all the people around him who was protected for so long, <laughs> you got to come outside right now. The Stevie J's. You still want to fight? You still want to fight, Stevie J? <laughs> I to put up another Dane dudes. You still want to fight 50, homie? I don't think so. Now, y'all, you know what I'm saying? And that's why, back to what I was saying about, that's why they act so tough. They act so tough because they know there's whispers about them. So when I see you in person, I got to show you, I'll f you up. I'm gangster. I'm this and that. That's an act, man. Real gangster can see you through all that shit. All I say, Puffy should have just lived his life, man. You still could have been on top of the world, enjoy you. It's a it's a world full of love. What's That's wrong fair. with you living a world full of love? Even if you loving men, you full of love, bro. You ain't gotta try to come over here and 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 um maintain a character that forced you to be a monster. Cause you wanna be on top, you wanna control monsters, you wanna control, you want gangsters to respect you, you still wanna be able to slap a nigga in his mouth. You can't do you can't do both. You can't do both. You can't be a gangster, you can't be Omar from the wire, bro. Like, you're not that. And it backfired on my boy. Like I say, it's a lot coming out, boy. Check out, it's a, it's a rapper coming out with a documentary, and when it come out, everybody gonna be surprised. I think it's, man, that's gonna be the, that's gonna be the, 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 the shocker right there. I heard some sh I was hearing sh Golly. and I thought it had pause. As it was being presented to me. Man, I was a I was I was I, 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 I don't know how to feel sorry for people all the time, but at that moment I was like, damn, bro, because I was in the same situation. And what if he, you know, ever would have came at me like that, I'd probably be dead or, you know, anything, you know what I'm saying? Because I ain't no telling how I would have reacted. But I pray. When did you hear? You don't have to say the guy's name, but. um, It's kind of hard to explain because it's hard to explain because then you're going to figure out who I'm talking about. Um, But I was also on the phone with somebody, right? And we was discussing and he was telling me, um, I was like, you know, that nigga don't like you. He hated your guts. And y'all became best friends. He said, man, I want to tell you something, man. He said, I never told nobody this because it ain't my motherfucking business. He was like, I'm just trying to feed my motherfucking kids. And he was like, um, he's like, man, such and such. One night, you know, I remember when we was fool. I'm like, yeah, he's like, man, somebody had wanted me to go, you know, deliver a message. It was important, important. Like, I had to do it. And I kept telling the person that, Puffy busy, Puffy busy. He's like, oh. He need to be, go tell him right now. He said, long story short, I went to the security guard. I told him how important it was. He let me in the room. And when I came in the room, I seen Puffy busting. He was getting it in. And he said, that's kind of like why. He said, and I never sprayed his secret. He said, and that's kind of like why I got it. You know, like, I can't even say it because you're going to know what I'm talking about. But he just told me, like, that's why everything started falling for me. Everything started happening good with me. That's why me and his relationship still cool. But I want to know. I want to know from the Bentleys. I want to know. Like, I know about, I know. I don't want to put these people. Cause he, Man, bro, he got to say the name. Because now I'm thinking. I'm like, bro, I got to figure this out. So he said he walking in the room. Did he busting? I'm trying to figure out who he could be talking to. I know it was a guy he had been busting down. Probably me. I know Meek been getting busted. Why do you think Nicki Minaj left Meek? You feel me? Nicki Minaj knew Meek was, was swung the other way, but I know Diddy was definitely busting him. But dang, that's crazy. People got kids, like, but I would love for them to just, you know, take the time 
to get that clarity, bro. Like when I cried about my financial situations, that shit helped me a lot. It changed my life actually. Like I was in a suicidal state and sometimes we just need people to hear us. So if they going through something, I advise them to just get with somebody. And it's not about filing lawsuits or trying to be seen. It's just about having that therapeutic moment, um, that cleansing, that clarity and getting that shit out your system. That's assault. And he and he done it for so many years and got away with it. Like years. Like it became a it became behavior. You get what I'm saying? It it was it wasn't like a it wasn't like a like a once in a one once a month thing. It was a lifestyle. He was a monster in real life. And I knew about this stuff. But you can't prove it, and it's not my job to fucking try to bash public because that where I was coming from was a place of hate. So everything I said would have been taken. But I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. You go back to my old interviews. All this stuff that's coming out right now, I'm so happy. It's more. (laughs) It's more. But I'm so happy it finally came out. A lot of stuff, um, people don't understand, Puffy endured. A lot of stuff Puffy went through as a, you know, when he was younger. And I'm gonna leave it at that. Like I say, when uh this DVD come out, y'all check it out, man. You know. Um, we got we watched the icon fall. And a lot of people don't understand it's like a change in other guards. That's all it is. Like they stayed around, they played the game a little too long. And this is how God works. It's like hip hop is independent. You know, the music is independent. The owning of your masters is independent. It's a, it's, a, it's a new change in other guard. And all the old parasites is just falling off one by one. Because they never had talent. They just leashed on to the talent. Let me tell you what Puffy was. And what a lot of them is. They mediators. What they call them mediators, right? Uh, where you got to go. They go-betweens. So you got the, you got the Leos who who scared to, to approach the, the thugs like that. But Diddy from that world, so I could intermediate. I could get percentages from negotiating and making this deal, but you gotta give up that butt. You gotta give up that butt and royalties. And I could change your family life. What? Know why? Because he had to give up that butt. People don't understand. That's the reason, that's why it's the reason Puffy don't want to give nobody any artist he deal with, he'll tell you, I ain't gonna make it hard for you. Yeah, I had to do this. I had. He wants you to endure it, he endure it. And I felt bad in a sense because he was only trying to feed his family. You get what I'm saying? And Nah, bro, I don't feel feeding your family ain't got nothing. I, bro. There's many ways to feed your family besides giving up that butt, bro. Many ways, bro. If, it, if I got to do that, I ain't feed my family that way. I'm going another way <laughs> because it ain't happening. You hear me? Ain't no amount of money on the planet earth hurts me doing that, bro. What well, they tweaking? Talking about he got to feed his family. Man. He became a victim and it turned him into a monster just trying to hide his own secrets and not living his truth. And now he in prison just from the, all this. All this comes from one man not living his truth. I swear to God. Had Puffy just been who he as at heart, it might have been a few jokes. We joked about RuPaul. He's still a boss. You get what I'm saying? I feel bad for the people that got hurt trying to hide his secrets. All the people that have been victimized, all the people that have been uh, uh, put under the influence so they don't remember certain things because of who he is. And as long as you're under the influence, it ruins your credibility of speaking about anything. So I can understand why he kept probably kept drugs in the party. You get what I'm saying? All this is all this behavior falls in line behind one thing, trying to hide secrets. So now you gotta cut co- use this to cover that. And now this makes you cover for that. And it's just gonna get worse and worse and worse and worse and worse and worse. It never stops. It's a cycle. That's why I don't live in fear. I don't live behind I don't hide secrets. I don't I'm not scared of nobody. I don't do none of that. I, I live for God. Man, uh, you live that way, your ass ain't gotta worry about nothing. You know one thing that's crazy to me though, because I know him, is um me picturing them in the cell. And that sh- that sh- made me feel a little bad. That's that's the only thing. Like, 
I don't like the nigga or whatever, whatever, whatever. I still got love for the nigga. You get what I'm saying? Like, I wouldn't be in here right now if it wasn't for that dude. Regardless of what, it was 40,000 people. He had, to, he had to hear something from me. He had to hear my talent. He had to pick me out. He had to learn my personality. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't always easy to deal with me every day, too. They used to have shit on the, on the motherfucking refrigerator. We had a lot, like, notes of what, what people, when people come in the house, they'll know, you know, what to deal with or whatever, whatever. On the notes, they'll be like, let Fred sleep for extra 45 minutes. Like, this nigga is, like, because when I woke up, you know, I had a bad attitude and I used to get up or whatever, but they done did too much. They, they did a lot to help me get where, where I ain't going to say where I'm at in life because really it's like, where am I? I'm 40. I don't own the properties or nothing. You know what I'm saying? And people don't understand. Oh, are you blaming Puffy? I'm not blaming Puffy. I'm blaming Puffy. I can't get time back. I dedicated my time to a situation to provide for my family, which I'm talking about when I was into it, I was into it. I never went home like everybody got to go home on the weekends. I was the furthest away. So I was really dedicated to changing my situation. I was really dedicated and showed love to a person who I felt like in the end what I learned was only, was, only, was only playing with us and it made me react a certain way. But that don't mean I hate him. Well, that's good. He 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 got a you know a, a positive outlook because he could really 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 have hate in his heart. But it sounds like he really like you know has remorse for Diddy. Like for real, even though he know that Diddy deserve it, he still have remorse. You know what I'm saying? And um, I mean that shows you how mature of a man. I guess. I mean he is, and uh, I respect that a lot, but. Diddler, it's your time, my boy. You didn't did too much evil, man. Like I say, I'm covering this all the way up to the trial. You feel me? That trial, like I said, in all of the videos, boy, I'm, I'm really looking forward for this documentary. I'm looking forward for this documentary, bro. Like, I know 50 Cent doing it. He got to be because ain't no other rapper. Yeah, it's Diddy for sure. And Jay-Z, oh, he definitely got to be next. You got to be next, bro. Like, for real, man. But, man, wow. It's just, like, more and more stuff, bro. It's, like, it's getting worse. Like, they definitely going to R. Kelly him. That's a, like I say, if he make it to the trial. They're going to R. Kelly him for sure. He ain't never getting out. You feel me? But, hey, thank you guys for watching the video, man. See you guys next video. And always remember, be safe out there, kings and queens. Let's get it.